Uh, what brings us here today, my uh, producer Diana Williams and I, uh, we are building uh, the first ever video game franchise set in US politics. Uh, this comes out of my background as a political journalist. And as we increase our conversations around what we can do to both protect our democracy here and abroad, uh, we are deeply concerned with how is it that people are actually processing uh, these systems and internalizing them so they can be effective agents for change. And so just briefly, and I'll sort of point at our AV guy Alex there, um, with Political Arena, what we're hoping to do is to really let anyone, for the first time ever, uh, immerse themselves in our democracy. And I'm sort of staring over here at the screen until my ugly mug. There we go. Um, and this is just sort of one example of things folks are doing these days to try and bring people closer to our democracy, become more effective agents of change. And in Political Arena, what we want to do is let anyone and everyone sort of be the politician on the ground. And so players can customize their own politician, their background, their agendas, whether they have skeletons in their closet, whether they are upright or not so upright, and they enter themselves into a fully simulated political ecosystem, complete with legislating and campaigning and interns who get you in trouble because they publish something inappropriate from your social media accounts. And the hope is that just like Oregon Trail of yesteryear, that this is going to be a game that people won't just play, but they'll play repeatedly and really begin to internalize kind of what matters and what doesn't in our democracy. And what this goes to the heart of right now is arguably the biggest source of inefficiency in our democracy right now is people never really get to experience this firsthand. So they have a kind of warped understanding of what does and doesn't matter. Uh, anyone who's ever given money to a candidate who was never going to win or for that matter was always going to win is one such example. And so I'm just going to end it there. Uh, this will be playing for the next uh, 20, 30 minutes or so. Uh, my producer, Diana Williams, who in addition to being fancy and has produced lots of Star Wars products, so if you're a nerd like me, come say hello to her for that. Uh, but we'll just be hanging out here, kind of in the back, happy to talk about this. And otherwise, welcome to SoCap, everyone. Thanks.